the scammers have bender use the code to steal valuable objects from earth's past as well as stealing a doomsday device from professor fansworth storing them in a cave beneath the planet express building hermes also has bender retrieve an earlier version of his body so he can win back his wife although dr zoidberg accidentally reattaches his head the wrong way round meanwhile leela and lars date further depressing fry once the scammers have history's treasures they decide to get rid of the time code by killing fry fry uses the code to escape to january 1 2000 just after he was frozen the scammer sent bender after him bender arrives before fry creating a duplicate of himself when he has to use the bathroom another bender from way at the end then appears opens fry's cryogenic tube and puts the tattoo on his butt when fry arrives the first duplicate of bender inadvertently initiates a self-destruct sequence as a result of not going to the bathroom fry shoves that bender into another tube then escapes the original bender spends the next 12 years hunting fry finally catching up to him and seemingly killing him by blowing up his apartment a remorseful bender reports his success to the scammers who then erase the time code and the virus the crew holds a memorial for fry but he suddenly shows up fry says he used the time code to eat the unclaimed pizza that he delivered to the cryogenics lab whilst it was still warm being unable to buy pizza with 31st century money the resultant duplicate of him remake Ned in the past while he accidentally fell into his own cryo tube whilst retrieving his wallet when fry plus the fry that was originally frozen awoke 1000 years later the present fry froze himself until the current year meanwhile the fry in 2000 spent the years before bender's attack working at panucci's pizzeria then at an aquarium caring for lilu an orphan navel he also hung out w it his family intended to his beloved dog simo assess nibala removes the tattoo from fry to keep the scammers from further abusing it leela and lars decide to marry but during the wedding he rmes is again decapitated and his body destroyed fansworth says that this was inevitable since time paradox duplicates are doomed to die prematurely Hearing this, Lars panics and leaves Leela at the altar, devastating her. The scammers then trick Earth President Richard Nixon into giving them the last assets on Earth not controlled by them. Exiled to Neptune, the population assembles a fleet with the aid of robot Santa. Quinn Zabot and the Hanukkah Zombie Hermes has his bureaucratic brain wired into the ship's battle computer. allowing him to destroy the scammer's fleet and win back his wife when the scammer's threaten to destroy the planet express ship with the doomsday device that bender gave them unless the crew surrender bender secretly reveals to the crew that he had stolen the d a vice back from the scammer's for his own use leela then fires the device to destroy the scammer's ship and bender is rewarded for saving the world from the scammer's Unable to console a heartbroken Leela, Fry arranges for her to meet with Lars at the cryogenic lab. Just as Lars begins to explain to Leela why they cannot be together, Mudder ambushes them, having survived the doomsday blast. Lars tricks Mudder into approaching the cryo tube containing the Bender duplicate on auto destruct and holds him against the duplicate, who explodes, killing the three of them. The explosion singes off some of Lars's clothing, revealing the Bender tattoo and exposing him as a time paradox duplicate of Fry. During Lars's funeral, the Planet Express crew learn from Lars's video will that he was actually the Fry duplicate who had survived Bender's attack in 2012. The fire and smoke changed his appearance and voice. He froze himself to return to the future and be with Leela. However, when he learned that time travel paradox duplicates were doomed, he canceled the wedding to spare Leela the pain of his inevitable death. Leela forgives Lars and reconciles with Fry. Benda removes Lars's tattoo and terror. Wheels to 2000 to place it on Fry in the cryogenic tube so that the events that transpired make any sense at all.
Upon returning, Bender emerges with all the duplicates from his stealing sprees, Haven. She convinced them all to break the chain of causality. Terrified of the paradoxical consequences, Nibbler urges everyone to evacuate the universe before swallowing himself. The Bender duplicates explode and cause a tear in the fabric of space, leading to the events of The Beast with a Billion Backs.